I just want to welcome everybody here to the joining of Connor and Carrie, and I just wish to thank on behalf of the families, all of you that have been able to make it today. This is a very, very special day for these two. Connor, I've written these vows about 101 times, but there don't seem to be enough words to express how much joy and happiness you truly bring to my life. From the moment I met you, I knew that God had truly placed you into my life for a reason, and for this reason, I will forever be grateful to not only call you my best friend, but my husband. Three, two, one. Heavenly Father, it is such a blessing to be here this day with this young couple. And God, more than anything, I just pray your presence be among them every single day. Lord, as they wake up in the morning till they go to sleep at night, be with them, Father. Help them with their marriage. Help strengthen and show them ways that they've never seen before. Give them the courage, Lord, when they have to talk about something that's not comfortable to talk about. But always, God, be their light each and every day. And also, Father, I just do pray that every single day, Connor and Carrie will not hesitate to say that I love you. Do not let a day go by without those words being spent from your lips. We praise you, Lord, for all that you did, and we thank you, Father, now. Praise in Christ, and we pray. Hey! Oh, wow! You look beautiful. Thank you. You look beautiful. Mm. So proud of you. You look so pretty. I try not to. You're gonna make me cry. Ugh. Carrie, I know I respond to the question what you love about me with everything, but it's true. I love the way we can communicate together. I love every moment I get to spend with you. Moments that are never dull or boring. I love that big smile and personality that can light up a room. Most importantly, I love the way you love me. They've chosen something that's completely different than your normal unity candle. They have chosen a peanut butter sandwich. And Logan, you can have it after we're done. <laughs> but, but if you think about a peanut butter sandwich, it's, you don't really think about it, but if you do think about it, when you put the peanut butter on both slices of bread and put that bread together and smash it, can you tear that peanut butter sandwich apart cleanly? No. And just as you two join hands today, once you cleave together, you will not be torn apart by anything. Not only today, but on every single day for the rest of our lives together, I promise to be your loving, supportive, adventurous, animal-loving wife who will try not to bring every dog home she sees. I promise to always be there for you through every good and hard time. I promise to pray not only with you, but for you on a daily basis as we continue on this journey that God has laid out for us. As we step foot into our new chapter as husband and wife, I will continue to love you and choose you every day. So Connor, I do. I did last year on January 25th. I do today, I do tomorrow, I do forever. I love you.
I promise that I, was all, I will always love and support you no matter what. I promise to be, to be the best husband I could possibly be for you. I will always be there to help you reach your goals no matter how big or small. I'll love you forever and always to the moon and back and to quote Buzz Lightyear. I love you to infinity and beyond. Friends and family, and as much as Connor and Carrie have committed themselves to each other by the authority of the state of Georgia and by the power of majesty of God Almighty, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Connor, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you for the first time, Connor and Carrie Threckold. Today has been one of the craziest, best days of my life because I finally got to see my best friend get married. <laughs> I have been waiting for this for a long time. So, Connor, thank you for that. <laughs> I have never seen Carrie as happy as she is with Connor. You have made her the happiest I have ever seen her in the, all the years that I've known her. And I am so thankful for you that you get to bring out the amazingness that is my best friend. <laughs> they're, they're like two peas in a pod. And yeah, I think y'all do great together. Wish y'all all the luck in the world. And just know we're always here for you. We love you. And I think you've got a great family. And y'all make a greater make it a greater family. Love you guys. Carrie and Connor. I love you. I couldn't be more proud of you. I'm honored to be your best man, and I'm even more honored sharing this special moment with you. And Carrie, Thrackle couldn't have picked a better woman, and honestly, I love her to death. Let's raise a glass to the newlyweds. Here's to a life full of smiles, memories, love, and happiness. Here's to Mr. and Mrs. Corner Thrackle. But I just want everybody to raise their glass to my best friend and the amazing man that she chose. So congratulations, y'all. So cheers to watermelon moonshine, y'all. Yeah.